All right, so to get started with this whole concept, at the bottom of this script, wouldn't it be nice if we gave the user the indication of what opens and closes the door? Yes, right? Because how's how are they going to know what E and R does on the keyboard, right? So back in this land of wonder, no, not this land of wonder. I thought I had a GUI script. Yeah, there's a GUI label down here. Let's take this GUI label and copy it on from Raycast, put it on the door, and move it down a little bit. So we're going to move it down to 300 units. And we're going to make it 300 units wide. And it's going to say E equals open the door. R equals There we go. And to get the full effect of this, let's play on maximize. Yeah, there we go. So it actually makes sense. Okay, E, R. E, walk in the room. Not too bad. Closing the door is a little hard, but I got to get that little block to be maybe a little bit more in line with the door. Because right now it's really hard to tell where you got to stand. So obviously I got to move that block around a little bit to make it a little easier. Okay, that's easy to fix. Something else that needs to happen here is this intensity of this thing needs to be turned down a little bit and I'm starting to need another light source in here this point light what I want to do is put this inside this building just like that so I walk around and I can see this light something going on in this room perfect not bad all right so that's what I want just a, a couple little things in there to kind of beautify it up a little bit you know now we're going to start getting in a little bit more into the aesthetics of things um, what I needed to do to get to, I needed you to get to a point though that you can open and close the door. And it took a couple lessons to do that. So, in the next series, we'll go on and learn a little bit more about scripting and a little bit more about beautification in some manner. Oh, and turn in this project using the file build project settings build it in a web player you're gonna get that index file just like you did in the last couple videos uh, for the projects those two um, index files are what I want you to turn in alright enjoy and on to the next lesson